Hey guys, Dan Burnham here with DanBurnham.com. Today I want to do a comparison between a big bore horn, an MF Holton LT302, Ferguson model, versus Callet Jazz Generation 2 by Lee Adams, Callet.com. So we're going to start out in our mouthpiece of interest on this video will be a simply A7C. I want you to hear the core tone of the horn. So I know I've done a lot of high range stuff with the MF protocol and stuff like that, but I want to showcase this horn and show you what it can do. 470 bore, but it's an expandable board, so don't let the number 470 scare you. Right, I'm gonna try to play the same tune on both horns and let you let you hear them. That was the Callet Jazz Gen 2. Now we're going to put the 7C in the Holton. You tell the difference which one had more core I, I realize that uh, what you're looking for and what people want to hear and what they hear can be two different things but the comparison is this the Holton's a great horn but it just doesn't respond it respond like the uh, the Cali Jazz now we'll do one more Okay, we're picking up the pace a little bit. Let's switch back over to the uh, Callet Jazz. Do you notice the core sound of the Callet Jazz? It just kind of, see I'm taking a box 7C and you're getting that smoky jazz sound. Not really even on a jazz mouthpiece designed for that. So um, I hope you enjoyed the jazz by Callet, Callet Jazz Generation 2. It's a fantastic horn. It's not just for screaming. It's not just for, you know, high register work. It's a good all-around horn. You can do orchestral work with it. You can do commercial work with it. Uh, anything that you need to do with one horn. If I, if you ask me, if you could have only one horn, what would it be? And I would have to tell you, Callet Jazz Generation 2 by Lee Adams, Callet.com. Guys, hope you enjoyed it. Have a blessed day.